Hi, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us for our webinar, Embrace Your Customer's Mobile Addiction and Make More Money. As we gear up for school this fall and for fall sports, this webinar is going to be pointed towards the sports and events and schools markets. So if you're photographing sports and events and or schools, you're going to get some great information that's going to help you in a big way this fall. First, I'll provide a quick background on the partnership between Millers and Capture Life before we get started. Millers has been working with Capture Life for the past year and a half or so to integrate a new digital fulfillment solution into all our ordering systems and then connecting all of this into our ability to create more reorders for you. We now live in the age of every consumer having a smartphone, so we're really excited to be bringing you this new offering, and we know it has a lot of possibilities for sports and events and schools. I'll start off with some introductions. My name is Paul Rotter. I'm the marketing director at Miller's. I've been here at Miller's for six years, and I've been very involved in the process of integrating Capture Life with Miller's. I'll also introduce you to my two co-hosts for the webinar. First, the VP of Business Development for Capture Life, Jeff Eckerly. Jeff's a co-founder of Capture Life and has been working with photography businesses of all sizes to incorporate Capture Life's digital delivery benefits into their businesses. He has a deep background in building software platforms, but more importantly, and you'll hear him talk about this in just a minute, the Capture Life solution was built from the perspective of a parent who buys professional photography. Also joining us to co-host today is T.W. Woodward, Customer Success Manager at Capture Life. T.W. is an incredible resource, especially for the sports and events and schools markets. He's been running a youth sports photography business and lab for nearly 20 years, and he has a wealth of knowledge on how Capture Life digital delivery can benefit sports and events and schools photographers. So here's the agenda. Here's what we're going to be covering today the opportunity for you, the social mobile consumer, the new digital experience, how to make more money, how it saves time, and how you can get started. We'll also have a Q&A section in this towards the end of the webinar. If you'll notice, there's a questions panel on the right side of your screen as you have this loaded. Use the questions panel to ask your questions as we go through the webinar, some of these I'll be able to answer directly to you in this questions panel. Some of them I'll save so that we can address them to the larger group. But rest assured, if you ask a question using this questions panel, it's going to come to me and I'll be able to see that for you. So without any further ado, we'll go ahead and get started and I'll turn things over to Jeff. Hey, well, thanks, Paul. And uh, good afternoon to everybody. Good morning if you're on the West Coast. Um, Here's what we want to start with here is really talking about uh, the opportunity. And it's all around how professional photographers can better price, bundle, package, and deliver digital images with print orders. And we're going to talk about how doing that can save you money, can make you more money, and help you win more business when you're selling to a school or to a sports league. To start off, I want to talk about some consumer trends. And we, we all know that consumers are addicted to their smartphones. Um, the, the amount of time they spend on phones has been rapidly increasing over the years. And a lot of that time, the highest percentage, over 90%, is done in apps, native apps, more so than browsing situations. And, and so when we think about that behavior with what you all do is create great content around memories, um, we need to marry, marry these things up because the consumer wants to share content on social media. Um, they want to brag and show off um, you know, the most important things in their lives and what they're doing. They want to save those digital images and they continue to spend more time in apps. And of course, Amazon has, has totally gotten them accustomed to a mobile buying experience um, when, they, when they buy all kinds of things in their life. So it's important that every business think about how am I um, you know, providing that mobile buying experience. And then even more important, uh, millennials are now parents. And so the younger your parent is that you're targeting, the more and more they're going to be aligned with these trends. So before I go any further, I'm going to tell my story a little bit as a, a parent um, who has purchased a lot of photography. And really, this is, this is why we started Capture Life three years ago. Um, this is my refrigerator. You're looking into my kitchen right now. 
And about three years ago, I was looking at it and, and I, I've got two kids. They play a lot of sports. There's 50 magnets on this fridge. And I said, wow, I have smartphones. All parents have smartphones yet. I don't have the digital image for any of these photos. Why is that? Was I too cheap to buy it? Did, was it not offered? What, what, what's the reason? Was it too hard to get? And so my wife and I went around the house and we, we scrounged up another 43 different um, photography purchases, whether it was Santa Claus or school photos or portrait sessions or whatever, laid them all out on the table and said, this is really cool. We paid all this money for these prints, but we have no way to easily share them. They're not saved digitally. Um, this is a problem. So we went around and we, we dove into that, that uh, consumer need. We started working with uh, all kinds of photography businesses to learn and understand what this industry was about from the photography business perspective, because we knew what we wanted as consumers. And that, that ultimately led to um, the creation of Capture Life. So, so that's, that's my story, my background. Again, like Paul said, uh, I come from the software world, and so does uh, the other founding partner at Capture Life. And, and we're here now bringing this solution to an industry that we wanna see uh, align itself with where consumers are today. So some of you may look at this and say, well, I, I do sell digital images um, today, but if you do, you're probably doing it through one of these means, um, you know, thumb drive, CD, download, whatever it is, this creates work for the consumer. The consumer has to um, do some kind of effort to get that image. Uh, and then of course, some of these, you know, you can't stick a CD or a USB drive into a smartphone, which is where they are. So they have to go through the trouble to get it to their smartphone if that's where they want it um, but the the bigger problem with this is that once they have that image you don't know what they do with it they could um you know take it somewhere else like shutterfly costco amazon and print other products and you're totally shut out of that transaction um, you, you're not participating in the fact that they might be saving all the photos that you sold to them in one place and the value of that actually increases over time because you know, it, the, the, the longer it is since a photo was taken, the stronger the memory is. So this dead-end transaction and keeping the content that you created um, connected to that consumer and the relationship between you and the consumer through that content is really what we're trying to do here to help the photography industry. Um, because we know that if we can connect photographers with customers, we can drive more revenue. We've already proven this out. And, and when you talk to consumers that understand a uh, photographer, photography business that's that's delivering their content through Capture Life, they get really excited. And we'll, we've seen they will pay more for this modern digital experience when it's bundled with prints. It increases the perceived value of what you're selling. And it also makes it easy for them to share and save, which when they share it, again, because we keep you, know, you connected to them and any additional purchases, there's an opportunity to sell more to other people they might invite in. So to sum up the solution, um, what we're promoting here today is that when you deliver Capture Life or you deliver digital content through Capture Life with your print order that you bundled together through Miller's, which you'll hear is very, very easy to do. It doesn't require any additional work for you. Um, you now have the, 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 the solution that the consumer wants and, and you increase the perceived value of what you're providing. So just to show you what this, process kind of looks like. Um, we call it the new customer journey, which is mobile social commerce across all aspects of their life. What Capture Life does through Millers is it gets that digital content directly to their smartphone, gets them into the app where they then can invite other people, which expands your potential buying audience. And then we have the ability to do um, uh, sell additional content, di different backgrounds or additional looks, um, additional captures so that you can maybe bundle one image but then sell additional images once you get that customer into the app experience. Uh, we also have new products um, called uh, videos that we can compile on your behalf and deliver video as well. Uh, this is, and we'll show some of that in a little bit, but, but this is all part of the getting you in the mindset of, of selling not just prints but prints bundled with the digital opportunity. And of course, we have in-app purchasing of print products that's connected right to the MPIC store uh, from inside of our app. 
And then we are connected into the MPIX marketing campaigns so that promotions that MPIX is offering uh, get sent directly to your customers without you having to do anything, which drives more buy made. So with that, I'm going to move into a demo mode here and show you how some of this um, appears to the consumer. Uh, the first thing I'll do is just show a couple slides. So um, when you place an order through Miller's and include Capture Life in a package or however you're going to set it up, that customer will get a text message and an email from you. So Snap Photography is just a, a fake name here. But whatever your company's name is would appear where you see Snap Photography. And then the customer, if they've already got the Capture Life app, taps that link and they are right into the Capture Life app if they're on their phone. If they're on a computer, they tap the link in the email and it opens up a browser. Uh, if they don't have the app yet, it takes them to the App Store. They download the app and then there's no credentials they have to give. We have you know, put passwords behind the scenes so that they're able to get right to their content. And what it looks like is this. Now here's an example of a brand called ABC Photography, but where you see ABC Photography, that would be your brand. That's what they see as soon as they get their first glimpse of your album. Then they tap into that, and they're now able to see the photos and browse through. I'll show you in a second. And then this is an example. When you hit the print store button, MPIX comes up, and you're able to um, you know, make MPIX purchases right from within the, uh, the experience of Capture Life. So what I'm going to do here is flip over to my phone. And now you're seeing my phone that I have in my hand. And if I flip out of this, you'll see that these are different albums that were delivered. There's a baseball um, photo that was delivered, baby portraits. Um, this is all one customer's account. So uh, every time you deliver content, it gets put to that customer's account. This happens to be the school photos that we were just looking at. And you'll see that um, you know I've got a number of images here. I don't know how you usually sell your school photos, but let's take this as an example where let's say you packaged in the, uh, the gray, standard gray background with, you know, two 8x10s, a 5x7, and whatever else. So the customer gets this image. Your branding comes through on the bottom there, um, but we're also giving them additional versions of that image, or it could be additional different captures, whatever you want, that can be sold here as additional digital purchases. Uh, that they can unlock by adding to their cart and you set your prices and, and then you know we check out and now um, that customer i'm not doing it right here but that customer now has multiple images here that are unlocked so this is a way of, of upselling more digitally of course if i want to hit the print store i'm going to do that and then this will bring up mpix and we'll be able to um, you know shop the mpix store right from inside of capture life if I go to prints, you'll see here that the photos um, are the same photos that were just delivered. Those are those same school pictures. So everything is tailored to a really nice mobile buying experience. And of course, if they do decide to go on the web, that all happens um, you know, through a, a browser as well. So it definitely works you know, mobile or, or web. Um, the other nice thing about here is that this plus button, I can hit that and I can share. So when I do that, um, I'm able to access my contacts, enter a phone number, enter an email address. And when I do that, it's going to send the exact same invite experience to whoever else you include. So you can invite grandma and grandpa and all the other people that might actually buy something um, or might want to buy something in addition to what the parent originally bought. And that's how we're expanding your potential buying audience. And you'll also see that you can add photos. So when I click add photos, that's going to take me to my camera roll. And as a parent, I can add more photos to this album. Uh, or I can create my own album. So really what you're doing here is you're delivering content to them into a private photo sharing app, which they then, if you sell this appropriately, are going to say, wow, not only did they give me the digital images and a nice experience, but they've given me more value. These images are getting saved in the cloud on, on, at no cost to me every time I buy from them. If I buy, if I have three kids at the same school, I'm going to get three different albums. And I don't have to do anything other than click the link. And, and, and the photography business has made it really easy for me to manage that. If I want to add my own photos, I can do that too. So that's the, the whole experience that 
that Capture Life is aimed at doing. Again, back to the origination of this, where it's it's doing it on behalf of what the consumer wants, um, and that's that's how you know in all our research with parents, that's what they want to have uh, the experience be when they're dealing with school sports photography. Um, the last thing I'm going to show here, demo-wise, is this from a web perspective. So uh, I'm still on my phone here, right? And you see all the different, you know, there's senior portraits, there's an event for a race, um, there's a wedding. So every time that, that a customer is around an event in their life, they can get delivered content. Well, when you start looking at this from the perspective of years over time, it really becomes something powerful for that parent. And again, this is something that you can sell to your principal or to your sport league about what you're doing as a part of your service. And again, you don't have to do anything other than just include Capture Life uh, in the packages that you're entering uh, into your Miller's ordering system. So what this is, this is a timeline. So remember when I said that I took all the photos from uh, that my wife and I could find in our house? Well, we scanned them in and dated them back so that if, if Capture Life had existed back in 2003 when my daughter was born, this is what we would have seen. Every time we bought photography, it would have been, you know, creating these uh, albums that uh, were delivered by the photographer. So we got a lot, you know, photos taken at Santa, two years old. And then we'll, you know, zoom, you'll see the years changing on the bottom. There's the first youth sports uh, four-year-old soccer. She's now 15 and plays soccer. So this, this actually as a parent really kind of gets me when I look at this because I can see the whole history of her, you know, over the last 11 years in a very cool way on this timeline. There's kindergarten soccer, another Santa Claus. Here's first grade. So here's a school picture. Um, here's a family photo shoot and more soccer, Santa Claus track. And now we get into 2011 where I started here in this example, start showing um, how this can be used as a, a personal photo, private photo sharing. Here's Halloween pictures. There's no professional photographer here, but a group of moms might have collaborated to take, you know, a collection of photos from an event. And then they all shared them through this Capture Life album, which is on the same timeline as the third grade basketball picture, the mini mite hockey uh, example. So you start to get a sense of how you are providing uh, this platform when you deliver content that solves the parent's problem uh, well beyond just getting that great capture. And the reason this is so important as an independent photography business is that I'm sure many of you have heard how uh, you know Shutterfly acquired Life Touch. And we know from our in-depth knowledge of this, uh, this market that Life Touch is out now selling to schools this sort of vision of what they're going to do with Shutterfly in the future. And what we and Millers allow you to do is to have that platform in market today selling and protecting your turf uh, against whatever Life Touch might be doing to you from a, a school selling perspective. So it's, it's really important that um, you think about this not just in you know, getting the digital image to a customer, but beyond that, as you think about where's your business going to be five years from now, and where's the consumer going to be five years from now, how, how does um, what we are enabling here fit into that long-term plan? And that's, that's really how we hope you're uh, you know, viewing this today and, and uh, you know, guiding your interest in Capture Life through. So with that, I'm going to hop back here. Again, I'm just going to review this one more time. They get a text and an email that gets them to their content either on web or mobile. And then um, custom, the customer taps here, they see their images and they're buying photos from the MPIX print store. So again, hopefully you understand that's, that's the, uh, the whole start of the relationship and what the consumer experience is. Now I'm gonna touch on one last thing here uh, about, whoops, sorry about that. Uh, I'm gonna talk about video stories quick. So this is a whole other reason why you want to deliver digital with your prints when you bundle this, this order together. This is a senior photos example, but it could be in Youth Sports Action or wherever you're taking more than one shot or, or multiple captures. When you start delivering digital, not only can you sell additional versions of that image, 
but we can start to create new digital products. Um, we do things like overlays or uh, multiple backgrounds or whatever from the same capture, but this is an example where we can automatically create videos um, for lots of orders at once based on a, a template and storyboard you build. So let's say you're gonna do 200 senior photos this year. You may say, well, for a girl, I'm gonna have this template and storyboard, and for a boy, I'm gonna have this template and storyboard. And then you take video and or um, stills, and you, you mash them together into a video with the click of a button, because we've set up this whole process of how to look at a stack of orders and create a unique video for every single order. And what these videos look like is, you know, it depends on the music and theme that you want to use, but this is the kind of video we can automatically create for, you know, as many orders as you want, just with the click of a button. So I'll just play this quick. Hopefully that's not too loud. But you'll see that the images being used here in this automatically created video are coming from the Capture Life content. So, so our hope is, is that you see that and say, wow, well, I'm going to already take these pictures. I'm going to give them all the digital because they bought whatever digital package you sell. And now for an extra 50 bucks, they can have this video and it's no effort for me to create it. Or maybe, maybe you just roll the video in to entice them to buy the digital package and you price the digital package higher. Now, these are all things you got to think through. But the point is when you sell digital, it's, it's possible to increase your average order um, with what you're already doing today. And that's really the, the foundation of what Capture Your Life is, is how can we create uh, more money, more opportunity for photographers without creating any additional work? And that's, that's really what we're excited about to bring to you. Um, so just my, my parting slide here, conclusion slide, is that reiterating this timeline aspect that each purchase builds on the customer's timeline so that as they you know, buy photos, whether it's child one, child two, um, wherever it may be, um, they receive those photos. They can share those photos privately with friends. They can create their own albums if they want to, share on social media, which I'm now realizing I forgot to show how to do in my demo, but it's very easy to share on Facebook um, or whatever social media apps that you have uh, you know, on, your, on your phone. Um, and, and ultimately, the, the big message that is important to say is that they're, you're saving, we are saving these in the cloud for them at no cost to them on an ongoing basis. And again, circling back to the Life Touch and Shutterfly message, that's exactly what Life Touch is going to be saying uh, if they're not already saying it in your market already. So I'm going to stop. I appreciate your attention to, to my view of this. I'm going to now hand it over to TW, and TW is going to take you through more details. Thanks, Jeff. Uh, as Jeff said, my name is T.W. Woodward. I've spent nearly 20 years in the photo industry leading a high volume youth sports photography business in the Minneapolis St. Paul metro area. And the business that I ran was vertically integrated. So I managed photographers and equipment, uh, the sales and account management teams, as well as the, the processing lab and technical data systems. To give you an idea uh, of volume at seasonal peak, we would process between two and 3,000 orders per day. I met Jeff and Scott, the co-founders of Capture Life, uh, early on in the development of the platform. And from the photographer's perspective and, and, and lab director's perspective, I knew that they had nailed this new ongoing relationship uh, between photographers and their customers. Uh, my experience in the industry um, in, in you know, guiding these technical systems in a lab really made Capture Life a natural next step in my career. I'm excited to be a part of the team, but I'm also excited to make myself available to you as a resource because I believe that Capture Life gives you as photographers the opportunity to provide a service that your customers uh, are looking for on Photo Day. As we all know, this is a time of great change in the photo industry. Uh, parents, our customers are looking for a new experience and, and new ways to share photos and play with photos. Um, at its core, you need to think about Capture Life as a product that you sell to your customers, much the same way that you sell an 8x10 or, or a photo set or a CD, whatever you sell on your order form, it, it's Capture Life it can be sold in that method. And 
yet Capture Life is different. It's a dynamic pros, uh, product that your customers purchase and it opens doors to wonderful new relationship uh, with that customer that expands your, your product line. At uh, Capture Life, we're going to talk about now what Jeff alluded to earlier, which is how we save money, make money, and win new business. And we're going to go through these three from the photographer's perspective, so you have a handle on on how you can um, use Capture Life to to make you know to to do these, to save money, make money, and win new business, but also how to compete as an independent photographer against uh, some of the big bigger players that, that Jeff mentioned either, uh, excuse me, before. Um, so before I get going on these topics individually, I'd just like to share a quick joke with you that we have here at Capture Life. At the last trade show, um, I asked a photographer, do you still sell wallet photos on Photo Day? And the answer was, of course, yes. Uh, we still sell wallets, they're, they're popular. And, and my next question was, well, when was the last time, you know, you met an old friend and they pulled a wallet photo out of their, you know, reached into their, their pocket and grabbed their wallet and showed you a photo. And, and the truth is that today they just don't. They reach into the, their other pocket and pull out their cell phone to show you their photos. Uh, I personally look at wallets as social sharing, you know, wallet photos as social sharing for the past 100 years, whereas what we've got today, Capture Life offers... Uh, a new method to be a part of this new engaged social interaction. So let's take a look at this first uh, bullet point, how you save money. And um, right off the bat, uh, we, can, we can look at the pricing of CS, uh, CDs and USB production. Um, you know, Miller's pricing uh, for CDs, if you order it through Miller's, is, is $2.50 for one image, $4 for multiple images. Whereas when you deliver digital images through Capture Life, it's only $1.75. And if you have ever tried to produce CDs or USB drives on your own, um, I know in our production facility, uh, you really had to stop the presses, engage a lab tech to, to find the images, burn a CD, you know, create a label, find an envelope. It just, it really was, you know, the cost of labor was high. And, and the production cost was high. This is automated through Miller's studio software. And so this delivery not only is less expensive, it's going to save your time to deliver this way. And keep in mind, as Jeff mentioned, CDs and USB uh, sticks are, are dead end transactions that don't promote any uh, continued relationship with your customer. Uh, those customers were lost to big box or, or online commodity printers where you no longer control the, the color and quality, which ultimately can reflect back on your work. And, and you didn't even have control. They just took it wherever, whatever they wanted. When customers purchase additional products through Capture Life, um, they're actually purchasing them through the MPEX print store. And, and, and those products are produced through Miller's lab. So you can, you're insured of that same uh, quality and, and that, you're, that you're used to with Miller's. Uh, another joke I like to share is when was the last time you saw one of your customers take a CD and stick it in their phone, right? Or a USB drive and stick it in their phone. There's just no good way to get pictures from a CD or USB drive to where uh, our, our parents want them, which is which is right on their, their phone. I can't tell you how many times I'd see a, a, one of our pictures show up on Facebook that we did not you know, sell digitally to the customer because they just took a picture of our picture with their phone and then posted it on Facebook. Capture Life, let, let's, Capture Life gives photographers the option to bypass all of that stuff. And, and those customers are telling us what they want. They want these images on their phone. And, and so Capture Life gives photographers that opportunity to, to bypass all of those steps and, and deliver what, what parents want. Moving on to the next, uh, bullet point here, you know, Capture Life is, is a new opportunity to make money. You can bun, bundle digital uh, with, uh, with your print products. Keeping in mind, you know, parents still want the printed products that they've always ordered, but they, they also want this experience of a uh, mobile experience of having their images on their sm smartphone. Adding Capture Life increases the value of your package offering because it gives parents the experience that they want. So be sure to raise prices. Keep in mind, 
Capture Life is a product that you buy from Miller's Lab, much like an 8x10 or wallet photos. You need to sell it to your customers in a similar fashion. And when your customers share, as Jeff mentioned, through Capture Life, it, it leads to additional sales. It's an entire group of customers, grandmas, grandpas, aunts and uncles that did not have access to your paper order form when you know mom made that initial purchase. Those, they're all activated through social sharing. And included with that social sharing is a marketing platform, a new way to reach out to customers. As photographers, we've never had this. It, it was, in my perspective, a very tall order to, to, to say, here's an eight and a half and by 11 piece of paper, go ahead and market your entire photo service on an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper, give it to a parent and, and let them order you know, your photos and your services from that. You know, Capture Life on the back end opens up this wonderful marketing platform. You know, think of your school photos that you're about to take uh, this fall that can be remarketed just before Christmas, you know, as a gift idea. We're going to look at some more examples of this in just a moment. But for now, let's move on to the next uh, the next bullet point here, which is how you can use Capture Life to win new business. And as a photographer and running a photography business, this is actually, you know, my favorite uh, point here because if you become the photographer in your area and Jeff just mentioned it if you haven't heard it yet we're getting this from photographers that we're in direct communication with that um, you know life touch is already sending this message and and to compete against that um, you need to arm yourself with the ability to to offer this digital mobile experience and I like the idea of going in to meet with a, um, a youth sports league board or a school advisory panel and, and let, letting them know that I am that photographer now. I, I, I've got products and, and I'm going to show you, we're going to do a little bit of hands-on with some example order forms in just a moment here. And, and, and I'm going to show you how you can not only put this on your order form, get it, you know, how to, how to market it and sell it, but you could also take that into your, your school panel or your youth board, uh, keeping in mind school principals and secretaries and youth athletic board members are all parents that purchase photography. And, and they're the, the gatekeepers, the people that you're selling to. Um, and they're all part of this customer group that's demanding this new experience from photo days. So if you can walk in and differentiate yourself by saying, I've got this wonderful product, and and it's it's really transforming uh, the way we're we, you know we're we're looking at professional photography. You can quickly become that photographer in that area that that's winning that business. And again, we're going to look at this. Like, from my opinion, Capture Life becomes a wonderful loyalty program. If you just saw those screens where Jeff was flipping through, you know, year after year of pictures, those can all be from you. You as a photographer can say. You know, try going back to a principal after a couple of years and go, here's your pictures of your son, your daughter, here's the twins, and you're flipping through them. It's going to make that decision for that principal to go to some other company really difficult because you're the photographer that has provided that digital experience and, you you know, used Capture Life as that, that loyalty program where these images are showing up year after year. But let's take a look at a hands-on, let's, let's look at an order form in this next slide. And I just wanna go through, sometimes it's hard to conceptualize how to sell this. And, and I wanna go back to, this is a product that, that Miller's offers you, uh, much like they offer any other product. And so it needs to go on your order form as, as any other product does, and you need to mark it up and sell the service. And so let's take a look at this. Um, this example here is, using Capture Life to increase the value of your package, uh, your package offering. This is a typical school or sports prepay order form. Um, and what we're essentially doing on here is underneath the, the gold photo logo, we're notifying our customers that Capture Life digital image delivered to your smartphone or computer is available. And in this case, I put the logo here and, and, then, and then I tag the logo onto the different packages so, so parents can associate what they're getting. I've also added uh, Capture Life as an a la carte delivery option. And in this case, I put it as $30. Um, 
the reason I did that is so that, you know, parents that are thrifty or, you know, that, that break down, you know, they're, they're good shoppers and they break down the, the, what, what their value they're getting from that package. They need a way to say, okay, in this case, I could get digital delivery by itself for $30, or I could order one of these print packages. Again, keeping in mind that we're, we're, we're in this day and time where parents are still there. They, they're ordering, you know, their, their prints, they've always ordered their prints. And so, you know, bundling digital into those packages can make those packages more attractive and uh, raise your average sale. Now, at this time, I just want to um, stop and, and say, you, you do need to collect email address and cell phone number. If you haven't been doing that, you know, that is the delivery of Capture Life to somebody's cell phone obviously has to happen through their cell phone number. So um, you do need to, to change your order forms to be able to do that. And I know on our order forms, I added a, a privacy note that said, by providing your um, cell phone number and purchasing digital content, um, you're essentially opting into receiving the image via your cell phone. Um, I've got, uh, we'll talk about this, but, but I've got um, these logos and things are all available to uh, photographers that are interested. Um, I've got some other wonderful logos of a mom holding up a phone that, that shows a, a soccer player or a school photo. Um, we will send you a link to that material. You're welcome to download it because it will help you illustrate this concept. You know, we need to get this message out to parents that, that this is available. And so we'll get you a link to that marketing pack. Um, on this next slide that we look at, um, we're going to look at a different type of order form. And in this case, um, what we're doing is we're adding Capture Life pretty much across the entire form. And so what's happening here in this, this breakout panel, it says new digital image delivered to your smartphone or computer included free with every order over $25. And now what I would advise you to do from a, a photographer's perspective is we just saw in that panel before that it's um, $1.75 to deliver the, the digital image. Um, so take a look at what your average sale is. I mean, there, there's some leagues or groups where the average sale might be $15. There's some, you know, that are, that are higher end stuff that, you know, depending on, on the group and, and your geographical location where your, you know, your average sale is up into the $25 range, whatever it might be. But think about pricing it out in this, in this way where, in this form, I've included uh, a Capture Life digital delivery to smartphone with every order over $25. I've included it in a la carte for $20, okay? So if I'm a parent looking at this order form, I can make my decision by saying, okay, I can get the digital delivered to my phone, which is what I want, and in a la carte, it's $20, great. Or I can pick the package that I always order uh, a lot of times those packages are going to be right around that range of $25, what we have we have here. And by picking that package, you know, this photographer is actually, that's just going to trigger this digital content delivery to my phone. Um, I think this is a, a really interesting way because this is the form that I would take to a league, a new league, and say, hey, I am the photographer that provides this this digital content because with this form, it's pretty much, you know, everybody is going to get digital content uh, delivered to their smartphone with this form. Um, I can't tell you how frustrated we would get when you'd go in to present to a youth athletic board, for example, and, you know, you'd make your presentation and you have, you know, wonderful services and, and, and everything. They, they'd ask you to leave their form. The next two or three photographers would come through and do the same thing. And then those board members would say, okay, let's make a decision on this next month, right? And the board members would reconvene. They'd come back together. They'd, they'd have these three or four order forms in front of them. And they say, oh my gosh, how do we make this decision? <clears throat> They've completely forgotten, you know, what you had presented. And so they have these forms in front of them that say, okay, let's take a look at package E. Package E on one form is $12, on another form it's $13, and on this form over here it's $11.50, right? And, and Oftentimes they would make their decision and just say, okay, it's 1150. It's the same package. This must be, you know, the, the better value. Let's, let's just go with this photographer that's got package E for 1150. 
the reason they were doing that is because there was no way to differentiate the services. The, 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 the people making the decision did not understand that there was a difference between services because in large part, there really wasn't. If you are this photographer providing this digital experience and you are in that board meeting showing how these images can are showing up on these these the parents cell phones keeping in mind again these people are parents too that want this experience and when they see those images on you know being delivered to some their their cell phones now that's a differentiator that's something that you can take and, and make yourself stand out from the rest of the the photography companies that are presenting um and one of the things I want to point out, and the reason I like this form is um, in order to get these systems started and this loyalty program started where, where parents are coming back year after year and, you know, their, your, your league representatives are seeing all of these parents engaged on their, their phones with, with your images, um, you know, we need to get this started now. So, you know, so that by the time next year when you have to, to present again to a board, you've already got an entire you know, set of parents that are used to um, having their, their photos delivered in this matter. For the, for the school photographers, you know, it's, it's spring and fall. For sports photographers, there might be three different seasons. I mean, there's already gonna be a collection of images being delivered and, and this loyalty program uh, is going to be built as you go through these seasons. Um, I'm going to go through the next slide, which is just basically a recap of some of the things Jeff said, some of the, the, the concepts that I've just put forward so that uh, we're all on the same page. And, and when you know we're off this call, you can feel comfortable moving forward. What we've said so far is that you need to use Capture Life as a digital product on, the, on photo day to raise prices of your packages or set a threshold to raise your average sale. In the past, digital content was going through through CDs or, or downloads, and not only was that more expensive, but it also meant the end of the relationship with your customer. Capture Life extends this relationship past photo day. You've given your customer the experience that they want, and they can easily share these images with family and friends using their smartphone. Once customers are engaged with Capture Life, Messaging campaigns can be scheduled with uh, coupon codes and, and gift suggestions around the holidays, for example. Um, and that in-app print store is filled, is fulfilled by MPix, which is, again, the lab that you chose because of, of quality and, and product offering. Uh, MPix print store is designed to compete with other national brands. Um, and so the offerings and the pricing and the quality, the convenience of MPix serves as an attractive option for additional ordering. Going back to it's, it, it's the same, it's the experience you know, of the same products and the same quality uh, that, that guided you to make the decision to use Miller's in the first place. And Miller's also has agreed to share revenue with you, um, with, any customer, so now we've expanded this customer base out through social networks, and Miller's has agreed to share um, revenue when a sale is made inside the, the Capture Life app. In a few moments, Paul will go over commission, the commission structure and just talk about that a little bit. But I wanted to give you an example, just so you fully understand that you've used Capture Life to make money on your order form, you've sold it as a service, You've gone past that dead end transaction, so now you've expanded the customer base. And then um, what we're looking at here is uh, a customer who would be engaged in MPix who would be making uh, a decision. And, and I just want to quickly say a note about reorders. There's, there's, I, I talk to many photographers uh, on a daily basis, and um, in our lab you know, we made money off of volume and, and reorders really uh, were a loss. I mean, it meant that a, a, a customer would call in and engage uh, my customer service rep uh, over the phone. Those phone calls, it might have taken two or three phone calls just to get the order down and locate the images and make sure that the order was placed. Then you'd, you'd engage a lab tech out of production to, to do a one-on-one -on -one order, print it, package it, um, ship it out. Um, for us, 
it, it, it just, it really didn't make sense. You could charge $20 for an eight by 10 on a reorder. And honestly, it took enough time and labor and cost to stop production, to print that, uh, that, that it really didn't, reorders really didn't make any sense. And honestly, parents bought what they wanted to buy on the order form. This moving into the MPIX store off the Capture Life app is an additional purchase. This is above and beyond what we could do before. And it needs to be considered, uh, you know, an, an additional purchase and an extension of the, the paper order form. So when we look, for example, at this here, keeping in mind that parents have already bought the prints that they wanted uh, from the order form, um, inside the app, so let's say we've got grandma who's now moving towards Christmas, gets a, she's had the image shared to her, now she gets a message on her phone, hey, it's Christmas time, you know, modern metals are a wonderful Christmas gift. Grandma never had access to ordering this picture. Now she does. She goes, hey, that would look wonderful on my daughter's wall. I got a picture of a buddy shot of her kids. I'm going to do a modern metal for uh, 16 by 24, and it's $121. This is a Christmas gift. Wonderful. You, Miller's is sharing 10% back. You get a $12.18 credit on that purchase. And you've done no work. This is an additional purchase that a, that a customer that you never had access to is making. And it's accumulating in the account. You don't have to get up and do anything. Miller's is going to take care of everything for you. Moving on to this last side, I just quickly, before I hand this back to Paul, I just want to say, you know, let's get started. Um, the whole reason I'm here at Capture Life is to help photographers, uh, you know, think through how we want to present this, how to get this out on photo day, and, and how to transform your business so that you can compete against uh, the messaging that's happening uh, out in the, the, the industry today. Um, we've got a wonderful marketing kit that you're welcome to use. Uh, again, uh, contact, you can contact me directly or we'll send out a link after the, um, the webinar. But it includes pictures like these where you can you can put these on your order forms and you can display mom, you know, holding up her phone so that parents can really get an understanding of, of what Capture Life is and, and that what they're getting when they make this purchase, you know, either through a la carte or on your packages. It also includes some table flyers and other things that, uh, you know, you can print banners and whatnot, um, all included in that pack. And, and so you're welcome to use that. Um, I'm here to help you incorporate Capture Life into your photo offering. Contact me for, for any more ideas. And if you're not a volume photographer, if you're a wedding photographer or an event photographer, please reach out. Capture Life fits into so many different workflows. I'm, I'm happy to help you find a place where it fits in. Bounce ideas off me. Uh, I'd love to help you move forward. And with that, I'm going to turn it over to Paul. Thanks, TW. Yeah, I'm going to jump in here and, and talk you through the Millers and Capture Life process. So we've heard about how Capture Life works. We've heard about why it makes sense, especially for the sports and events and schools markets. Now I'm here to tell you about how Capture Life works with Millers and how it's integrated so that you can use it when you're placing your orders with us. So really, the best part of digital delivery with Capture Life and Millers is how easy the process is. Since it's fully integrated into Millers ordering, through Remote Suite Plus Sports and Events and Remote Suite Plus Schools, you can fulfill your print and digital orders at the same time. So it's a big time saver. You don't have to worry about putting images onto a CD, a DVD, or a USB, or about having to upload images somewhere else after you've entered your order. You can do it all in the same place, which I'm about to show you in just a minute. Plus, there's the added bonus of color correction. Just like we do with your print orders, we color correct the images that are digitally delivered through Capture Life. So on this next slide, I'm going to show you an example of how Capture Life digital delivery works within Miller's ordering software. And since this webinar is geared towards sports and events and schools photographers, we'll focus on Miller's Remote Suite Plus schools and Miller's Remote Suite Plus sports and events. This option allows you to digitally deliver the image of a selected pose when ordering through the software. So as you see here, this is Miller's Remote Suite Plus School software. And if you're familiar with Miller's Remote Suite Plus Sports and Events software, it looks very similar to this. So it's both going to have the same look, and it's both going to have the same functionality for you. So first, 
you select to add single image capture life upload. Then you drop in your image. You'll also enter your client's name, phone number, and email address so Capture Life can digitally deliver the images to your client via text to their phone and via email. Now we had this come up in the questions panel, someone asking if you have to collect and enter both phone number and email address, which you don't have to do. You can only enter one or the other. Technically, we only need one to be able to digitally deliver the image file to your customer. But you're going to have a higher rate of adoption and a higher rate of usage if you can provide both. Some are going to interact more with the text. Some are going to interact more with the email. Some may even interact with both. You don't necessarily know that until you send them both. So that's what it looks like in the Miller software. Now we'll get to a list of FAQs. So the first question, how much commission do I make and how do I earn it? So TW touched briefly on this a few minutes ago uh, as he was in his section of the webinar, but you're going to get 10% commission on orders your clients place through the MPix print store in the Capture Life app using the images you shared. The commission will show up in your loyalty program dashboard on the Miller's website when the MPix order ships to your client and you'll be paid once a month at the beginning of each month for the previous month's activity. Second question, will clients with whom I share digital images see MPix branding in the Capture Life app? And the answer is yes, your clients will have the standard MPix ordering experience in the Capture Life app where they can order MPix prints, cards, wall art, and more. And I also want to point out that your customers will see regular MPix pricing in the MPix print store in the Capture Life app. This has come up in the questions panel a few times too, so I do want to address it here. You decide how you want to price the service when you put it on your order forms, but you aren't able to adjust the publish MPix prices for your customers on reorders through the MPix print store in the Capture Life app. So your customers will see regular, standard, published MPix prices that at this time can't be changed or customized. The next question, how does Capture Life digital delivery help me protect my digital images? Now, this is another one that TW touched on briefly as he was in his section of the webinar, but to give you a bit more of an expanded answer here, if you give your clients a CD, DVD, or USB with their images on it, they can take those images anywhere they want to have them printed. Not only do you earn no additional money when they order elsewhere using your images, you have no control over the print quality. So that's where the MPix print store in the Capture Life app comes in. You can rest assured that the orders your client places through the MPix print store will be printed with the exact same care and attention to detail that you've come to expect from your order at Miller's, and with the exact same care and attention to detail that have helped Miller's earn our reputation for having the highest quality in the industry. We've had this question also come up in previous webinars. Can't, can't clients who download their images from Capture Life still have them printed elsewhere? Yes, they can, but you'll find more often than not, they opt for the convenience of ordering directly from the app rather than going through the hassle of downloading them from the app, uploading them, and printing them elsewhere. Much easier for them to just order them straight from the app. Next question, how is this different from Zenfolio and other online galleries or hosting sites? Well, Capture Life is meant to be a simplified process for you to deliver digital image files to your clients but still participate in the second wave of print sales from that client. Once you've delivered the digital files through Capture Life, you can be hands off while your customers access their images through the app and you still make money on the reorders. And the last question that's on here, is this available now? And the great news is that yes it is and you can start with it today. So on this next slide, I can show you some ways that you can get started with digital delivery, Capture Life and Miller's today. First, if you aren't already registered for the Miller's Loyalty Program, you'll want to sign up at millerslab.com slash capture life. And that URL is up on the screen right now. millerslab.com slash capture life. Make sure to fill out your W9 and ACH information. This is what allows you to be this is what allows you to be paid when your clients order through the MPix print store in the Capture Life app using the images you delivered digitally. If you don't fill out your W9 and ACH through the loyalty program portal on the Miller site, we can't pay you commission. Once you've done that, you're ready to start with digital delivery. It is that easy and there's no real hoops to jump through. Just follow those steps and you're ready to get started. 
So the first way that you can offer digital delivery with your packages is through the Miller's Remote Suite Plus Schools or Remote Suite Plus Sports and Events software, which is the example I showed you earlier in this webinar. To do that, you select to add Capture Life Digital Delivery to deliver the image of the selected pose you upload. This option is $1.75 per pose. Now, if you order using regular rows, or maybe you're using Designer Plus, Remote Suite Plus Prints, or Remote Suite Plus Proofs, you also have the option to add digital delivery through Capture Life to your orders. When placing your order, select to add digital delivery of your printed images. This opens up a dialog box where you can enter your client's name, phone number, and email address so Capture Life can deliver those images to your client via text to their phone or via email. This option costs $3 per order and it will digitally deliver all of the images you've included in that order. However you use the Capture Life option, you can speed up your, deli your digital delivery workflow, you can provide a better digital experience to your customers, and you can start making more money on your digital deliveries. You'll earn 10% commission on orders your clients place through the MPix print store in the Capture Life app using the images delivered. So there is an opportunity for you to make quite a bit more money on this as your customers start to use it more and more and more. So now's the time in the session that we can do some Q&As. And we've had some questions coming up in the questions panel here in the, uh, here in the webinar. So the first one, and the one that we've seen most frequently and most often, is what stops them from taking a screenshot? Is watermarking available? And how does watermarking work with Capture Life? So TW, do you wanna take that one? TW, are you on mute? Thank you, Jeff. I was on mute. Sorry about that, guys. Um, there, there are a couple different workflows in the Capture Life app, and the one that we talked about mainly today on the order forms, um, photographers need to consider that selling Capture Life through the order form that manner, and then having it delivered, um, that was, you know you've sold the digital rights to that image at that point. Um, in that case, that image would not be watermarked and, and it would go out um, you know, as a product that you sold much the same way as if it would have gone out on a CD or, or a USB drive. There are use cases for Capture Life where um, what Jeff was showing, uh, we can have that premium tag put over the image and then that would protect an image. But that image, um, was not sold. So what that is doing is um, the customer would have to purchase the digital image with to remove that premium uh, watermark from the uh, over the top of the image. And so it's really two different selling methods that we're talking about there. Thanks, TW. Next question from the Q and A's. What about team or group photos? Someone mentioned they'd be cautious that one parent will purchase the digitals and share them with others. So in your experiences, what have you seen with that? So I have, in my direct experience with this, we, um, in selling photo CDs, we started by, with this exact same fear and it's, it's legitimate. And um, we were fearful that by when we sold a photo CD for $25, $30, whatever it might've been, um, if we included the team picture that that would have been shared around, um, you know, with the team and then we'd see reduced orders. And so in my experience with that scenario, um, what happened was we had so many customer service calls requesting the, the team image and, and asking us why we didn't include the team image and we were only giving the individual image that as a company, we had to make a decision to say, hey, we've got to stop these customer service calls. Let's just include both on the CD and find out what happens, we saw, um, we saw no decline in customer orders uh, by doing that. And so I don't know if that's a testament to the laziness of the customer or, but whatever it is, you know, in that scenario, you know, our, it, our fear did not come true. It was actually, you know, we got feedback from the customers and we decided to move in that direction and, and we saw, you know, no negative. As far as, you know, delivering through Capture Life, I, I you know, I don't, have an answer, I'm gonna guess it's similar where, you know, parents are gonna order 
the products that they want and in general it's going to be the you know the product that that individual image of their their kid is what they want and and you know keep in mind as photographers and as we move forward there's ways to get creative with this and and a digital package doesn't have to be just one individual picture and one team picture you could essentially deliver you know a trader card overlay on top of an image and include that as part of your your digital package and in that case you're creating you know products inside on a customer's phone that you know the team picture and them sharing that out becomes less of an issue because you're providing more value in a direction of you know unique products delivered right to their phone that that they're more interested in sharing those pictures of the individuals out onto Facebook and social media. Here's a great question for you. Do you have advice on how to get phone numbers from schools or do you only get the phone number from the prepay info? Yeah, I would, I would, I would for sure start modifying the order form so that you, you are collecting that information and build that into your workflow. Uh, to start moving forward with with digital products and, and digital delivery, um, that's something where when I talk to photographers, I, I've heard different uh, you know different responses. Um, some schools, you know, one photographer actually told me that um, cookies and donuts go a long way, is what he said. And what he did is he visited the school very nicely, went to the donut shop and bought donuts and talked to him about it. And, and was able to get the list with the with the phone numbers. I would I would certainly start with the order forms uh, to make sure that that is the, you know that you are collecting that information. Um, but schools are, are are awfully you know they have a lot of requirements for photographers, including making you know ID cards and, and security cards and, and things like that. So uh, I think we're seeing more and more data you know being passed back and forth. And from my understanding. Um, I don't think in this country there's a, a legal requirement that schools would not be able to give you that. I think it's a matter of, of engaging with the school and, and explaining why you need it. All right, here's one uh, that says, at what point in time is the email text message sent out alerting the customer the digital image is available on Capture Life? So the way that works in our system is when you submit the image file or image files, depending on how you place your order, through our software, if you choose to have those images color corrected, it will go to our color department first. And then once your image or images are color corrected by our color department, that's when we will release them for digital delivery. So once they clear the color area here in our lab is when they will be sent out uh, via Capture Live Delivery. Next question, are raw images uploaded then to the remote program? Are the Capture Life orders based on the crop in the remote software? So the answer is yes to the second half of that question, if that makes sense. So whenever you upload your image into the Remote Suite Plus software and then crop it in the software or accept the full crop, depending on how you've uh, cropped the image ahead of time and then uploaded it, that's what will be delivered to your customer once it clears the color department here in the lab. So what you see in the software after you've done any cropping that needs to be done and then hit uh, the, the upload or submit order button is what your customer is going to end up receiving as far as the crop goes. Okay, there's another question that uh, pertains to the end customer. So the photographer's customer who's ordering through the MPix print store in the Capture Life app. It says, does MPix mail the prints to the business or to the customer and do we need an address then? Well, on the reorder that's placed by your customer in the MPix print store in the Capture Life app, they'd be placing that order themselves. So they're going to be putting in their own address and they'll be putting in their own information. So they'll enter their own credit card information or their own payment information. They'll enter their own address. So at that point, it's completely hands off for you, the photographer, the end customer will handle everything from that point. So they'll handle the payment, they'll handle the address and the shipment and all of that. So you don't have to worry nearly as much uh, about how that order is getting to them or delivered to them. Since I was just talking about color correction, a question popped up, can you request no color correction? Yes, absolutely. Whenever you're ordering in software, there will be a button or a checkbox that is no color correction, and you always have the ability to order no color correct on your images or on your orders. 
So there's a few other questions that have come up, and I know we're kind of running long here. I appreciate you sticking with us for, for uh, more than an hour at this point on this webinar, and we appreciate your interest in uh, hearing all that we've got uh, to offer with Millers and Capture Life. Uh, some of the questions that have come up, I'm going to address these offline. So if you have an outstanding question that hasn't yet been answered, I'm going to go ahead and take all of these offline. I will email you separately after the webinar is over, and we can talk through some of these questions that I can get you, I can get you answers. But for the time being, Remember that you can get started with this today. Go to millerslab.com slash capture life. Get everything taken care of to sign up for the Miller's loyalty program so you can make sure you get paid on reorders. And if you have any questions, you see my email address up there on the screen, Paul R at millerslab.com. I am here. I'm happy to help. I'm happy to talk with you through any questions you have or anything that's going to help you in this process of getting Miller's and Capture Life digital delivery added to your packages and worked in for your fall sports and schools ordering. Thanks so much for joining us today. Really appreciate it. And again, reach out to me if anything comes up. Thanks so much.